Hello friends, welcome back to another video game experience with me, Bilbo. Um, we are playing Subnautica. Got this game a long time ago, only played a little bit. Um, it is a survival on a alien ocean planet game uh, where I crashed, my, my, this huge ship crashed, and I'm the only survivor for some reason. I, I'm the only one that got to an escape pod. Maybe everyone was like playing card games or something and they just didn't have time to get to the life pod. Um, I, however, take, you know, drills very seriously and this just, this time wasn't a drill, so. Um, I can go down into the water uh, by left clicking here and um, we are equipped with some cool goggles and I uh, don't think we have any fins. Oh, we, we've got, whoa, we've got little babby fins, I think. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> um, yeah, well, basically we just are going to kind of explore around and um, look for stuff, scavenge, and uh, catch fish because we have to eat the fish. Um, super futuristic, so like we have uh, a materializer thingy-majig in our, our pod, our life pod, that like in Star Trek when I need food, while it can't just procure food for me, which is kind of lame. Um, it will cook my food for me, so if I can catch this guy. Uh, he likes to run. Come here, buddy. Yeah, I can uh, cook up these guys later and um, have them for some supper. I think there's a fish that, that I get water from. Is it this guy? I think it's this guy. Yeah, yeah. He's like full of fresh water and I need to squeeze it out of him. Ah, yes, air sack. I, I guess it's not actually water, it's air, but, you know, we'll get fresh water out of that, for sure. Emergency. Oh. Ten seconds of oxygen and, of course, you must always be mindful of uh, oxygen in this game. Um, oh, it's telling me what to do. Break this limestone, and I punch it. Look, oh, if I hit tab, go to my PDA. We got a peeper fish, Caution. boomerang. Oh. This is new. By physical injury, 11%. Huh. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. Oh. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Oh, wow. Well, yikes. So the ship is going to blow up? Do I have to, like, make, like, get far away from it when it does? Will I be in real danger? I'm just going to collect some food for a little bit, because that's kind of first priority. If I see some damage... Uh, oh, there's some stuff on the ground. Oh my god, it's like a giant alien manatee. What are you? Hopefully he's docile? Oh. That guy's not. I know that. I gotta get this metal. Um, yeah, like, I really love to, um, to swim uh, in the ocean already, so this game is very much up my alley. However, the ocean is a very scary place, um, and this is an alien world ocean, so doubly so. Got some copper ore. That's good. Because you never know, like, what's lurking around a corner. Um, and uh, also, there's like an... Oh! Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me! <laughs> uh, there's like a night cycle. Um, so it gets dark and really creepy. What's this guy? Gary Fish! Oh, hello, Gary! How's it going? I'm gonna eat you later, just Emergency. so you know. Yes! Of, uh, of course, lady. I am aware. Oh, gotta stay up to get that last breath. There we go. Oh, this thing like deposit or expels bubbles. Like in, I saw you saw me do it a minute ago, I think. But yeah, so you can stay low. Just go back there to collect some more. Can I get this purple coral? No, I can't. I think I'll probably need it later. Ooh, more metal. You're mine, metal. So I can take these metal scraps back to the ship, and it will. Uh, de-atomize them or some such nonsense and um, 
we'll get uh, titanium, I think, from it. And we use titanium to uh, make tools um, and craft things, because this game, like many other games, is all about crafting stuff these days. And uh, it's great. Wow, look at this. This is beautiful. Oh. Local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. Wow, sweet. The Aurora's on dark matter? That's pretty cool. Yeah, we're, that's super future, guys. Super future. Oh. Okay. Well, here we go. Let's go back up into our pod. And I will use the um, fabricator. That's what I was trying to say. Um, we'll use the fabricator to cook some food. We're going to cook the peeper. Look at that. Instant food cookage. It's pretty sweet. I'm going to get some water from those air sac guys. Because look, as you can see, down in the lower left corner, our food situation is already 31%. We're pretty hungry. Um, so, we're going to cook up all these guys. We've got power up here, 46 out of 75. I think this pod just regenerates power somehow. Um, okay, we'll go to our menu. We'll eat some food. Oh, yeah, it even gives me some... There we go. All right, full up on all of our problems. Okay, I've got that scrap metal in my inventory. I'm going to turn in titanium. Four bits. Four bits of tight each. Transform. And then... Uh... See about making a tool of some kind. We use quartz to make rubber and uh, glass, I believe. It's kind of weird. You just uh, you don't use sand. Um, let's see. First, we need to get a, a knife. That is definitely for sure. So we're gonna make some rubber because it requires one. First things first. Defend ourselves. Okay. Oh shit! Is it gonna blow up? Oh shit, you guys. We gotta beat it. We gotta get out of here. Ten seconds! Here we go! Hold on, guys. We probably should get down here or something like that. Oh god. Oh, whoa! Well, oh great, that's the sound of radiation. That's bad. Get that quartz. Oh look, a thing. <laughs> I guess we're okay? Emergency. Oh, I gotta get Ten oxygen. Hopefully it's not just totally ready. irradiated up here. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Uh, I think that's what it looked like when, in the version I played. It was already ball blowed up. I don't know. I don't remember. I didn't play very long, so maybe it was the same. Can we climb up the side? That'd be cool. Oh, yeah, I can. Sweet. It's all that blue. Is that a glitch? I think some coloration is... Some odd coloration is happening here. Oh, it's just through the water. Okay. That is kind of strange. Looks cool, though. Anyways. Well, pod survived as well. That's... That's fantastic. Is there any? Oh, nope. Okay, back to the fabricator. So we've got we've got our knife. Um, next thing we need is a habitat builder, which requires a computer chip and a battery. Um, so let's see, battery. We have copper. We need acid mushrooms, which are those glue blowy things. Blue glowy things. Pardon me. Down there and um, computer chip. Is that what it said? I think so. Um, we need some table coral. Now that we have our knife, we can get some of that. And we need to find some silver, which might take a little bit more exploring. Um, so that would definitely be next on the list of to do things. Um, and table coral is just this brown stuff, I think, that is what we want. Mere quartz. Got to chop up this coral shell plate. And we'll break up. Common coral sample. That's not what we want, but these are the acid mushrooms to help us get batteries. So we can pick up a few of these. We don't want to, like, take them all. We're not that selfish. Let's get some oxygen. Oh, and these guys are... Oh, are they asleep? Oh my god, they are. Oh, yeah. 
Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. I'm gonna turn you into water to drink. Hope that's okay. Come here, boomerang. Oh, gosh. He sure is noisy, isn't he, guys? My goodness. Um, let's see. Anything up in here? No? On the ceiling? No. Probably should go get some air. Um, we haven't really, like, gone very far outside of our little home base area. Thankfully, these are really shallow waters at night, and, uh, they're not really scary. Not, not as scary, I should say. My gosh. <laughs> so loud um okay are these guys asleep too oh yeah try to run from me i don't think so okay quartz where is i think the table oh i know that sound um uh, oh thanks boomerang emergency oxygen seconds of oxygen remaining <laughs> hmm okay Sorry, keeping track on what we're doing. We're trying to find some silver and some uh, coral, some basic table coral. Oh, I have inventory full cram in it. Can I grab that guy at least? Yes, I can. Just, I don't think I can pick up the scrap because it takes four spots in my inventory. Oh my gosh, we are completely full up. Okay, well, I think... We're probably going to have to, um, we're definitely going to have to build some, uh, submersible chests or something so we can put our junk in them because we, <laughs> we don't have much room. Okay, let's see. I think I, I did get some food, but we already have some cooked, I think, so we should eat that. Old cooked boomerang. Oh, yeah. See, we lose some water if we eat it, but... It's not too bad. I'm just gonna eat it all. Drink this water. Okay. We've got some fish, some acid mushrooms. We could make, um, I think we can make batteries. Uh, yep. Which I believe we need, right? For it. Oh, this is the wrong menu. Um, <laughs> let's see, tools. Tools, Habitat Builder, we need a computer chip now. So we've got the battery, we just need that reef, and we need... Is there anything else I can just build, just to build? Any equipment, gear, pump air from surface? I'm not sure what that does, but... Ooh, if I had made some silicone rubber, I could get some normal fins. Let's do that. I think I needed two, is what it said. So we'll make these. And we'll have some proper swimming fins. Boom! Let's see, do they equip automatically? Yep, there we go. Translate vertical limb movements underwater into forward thrust. Perfect. Um, okay, can we make anything else in here? Uh, it doesn't appear that we can. Hmm. Okay, well, I mean, we can make this air tube, but... Uh, I don't really feel like we need it, to be perfectly honest, you guys. Uh, we probably should make some more water, because we don't have any more of those. We're going to go explore. I think I can just turn all of them, the uh, air sac or whatever the fish is called, um, into water, and that won't be bad. These guys can expire. If I get salt, ooh, pepper? Oh, salt, yeah, I can uh, cure them, and then um, they'll be tastier to eat. I think they'll last a little bit longer as well. So that would be useful. Oh, great. It is daytime again. Um, let's pick a direction and go for it. Let's say, oh, let's say the ship is north. So let's let's use the the pod as a uh, divider and we'll head, head this direction. Um, see if we can find some of those table corals. And we also need to find um, silver. I think just one silver will do. Um, that would be fantastic. Wouldn't it, guys? Wouldn't it? Let's get this guy. I'm not sure I'll be able to pick up much more, actually, after this. Got a bunch of titanium. Um, yeah, I have a lot of titanium. Is this... Oh, shit. The f what is that? 
Emergency. Okay. Ten seconds oh. of oxygen remaining. Get that copper. And get that oxygen. Oh dear. Oh. Oh, he's coughing. Sorry, dude. Sorry. Coral shell plate. Common shell. I think it needs to be the the, the other kind. It needs to be the other kind, you guys. Pretty sure it does, at least. Hmm. Alright, well, our search continues. Onward. We will explore these depths, and we shall chart them as territory known. What the hell is that noise? Is that like a freaking, like a whale? Oh, no. <laughs> I don't like those things. <laughs> Stay away from them. Scare me. Yikes. Um, anything down here? Suspicious? Not suspicious, but we can get this um, inventory full. Ah, drat. Okay, yes. Yes, of course. What about you, sir? Inventory full. I'll drink some water. Clear it up so I can get this titanium. Because I need that. I need that. Whee! <laughs> this game is so pretty. So very beautiful. Oh, wow! It's a giant one. Oh, my goodness. Oh, man. Look at all this stuff. It's just a ton of loot. Are there any baddies in here? Hello? Baddies? Doesn't look like it. Looks like it's just me and you, Reef. Uh, I need, I need, oh, I need to get this stuff. Oh my god. Uh, drop these guys. Get this guy. Okay, we're going back. I said I was going to make chests, and I completely forgot that that's what we were going to, we were setting out to do. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, we will make chests. The lady's reminding me that I'm a dummy, and I'm not breathing when I need to. Um, I was remembering that time, though. I mean, she only warned me, like, just as I got to the surface. She could have just, like, waited. But, you know, it's fine. Anyways, uh, okay. I think that is where I have to leave it uh, for this episode, though, guys. Um, but um, I'm going to have more episodes very soon um, where we will have chesticles to put things in. Um, I mean, let's just make one. Let me just look like one right now. Why not? Look at this. Look at this. Didn't even need to wait. Can go right back down. I don't have it because I don't have room in my inventory. <laughs> uh, can I make more batteries? Let's see. Yes, I can. I think I can spare some some room in my inventory by doing this. Okay, let's see. Uh, yes, I should be able to carry one now. Ah, we'll actually get something done. Um, inventory is still full. <laughs> How much space does it need, you guys? Golly, I guess I can make another battery still. No, I can't. I need copper ore, of course. Power cell. Um, wait, what do I need for a computer chip? Table coral sample and silver ore. I don't have the table coral. This is just crap coral. Um, thought it was the right one. It's not. Well, anyways. Well, failure this time, but uh, next time we'll get it. We'll get it right. Alright, guys. You take it skeezy. <laughs> and, uh, have a good day. Bye!